Now, forewarn weather with exclusive cutting edge technology to help keep you and your family safe. Well, we're stuck in a little chilly rut for a while longer, but I'm hearing there is a little bit of a warm up on the horizon. There's actually quite a bit of a warm up. We're going to go back in the mid to upper 40s, which so is nice. I know, but anyone that likes snow, that's right, going it's going to melt and melt away. So uh, we've got a shot again of the freighter that is now free on the Detroit River and temperatures are in the upper 20s, 26 in Howell, Pontiac and Adrian, 30 in downtown Detroit. You can see that camera shaking just a little bit there. We've got winds coming out of the west northwest at about 10 to 15 miles per hour, and that is putting an added chill into the air. Well, we had some sunshine today, but you've probably noticed the clouds moved in this afternoon, and we've got a few little areas of snow. Now, not as heavy as what we had last night. Shouldn't really affect your travel, but bridges and overpasses once the sun sets just after 5 o'clock will become a little slippery tonight, especially if they haven't been treated. But just spotty flurries to light snow showers as we continue to have the lake enhanced snow coming off Lake Michigan. It is snowing pretty decently up north. So if you are traveling up I-75, you'll run into a few bands of snow. Also, if you're going to the west in Grand Rapids or Kalamazoo. But around here, we're just going to see a few flurries, a few flakes up until about midnight tonight. So 9 o'clock, few areas of snow. By 6 a.m. tomorrow, we're starting to see a few more areas of snow showers. So your morning commute could be just a little bit slippery. And then by noon, mostly cloudy skies and we clear out in the afternoon. Big story, really how cold it's going to be overnight tonight and once again tomorrow, although not quite as cold as it was today. 29 in Mount Clemens, it is 26 in Pontiac, 27 at Metro Airport and 28 in Monroe. But you factor in those winds and it feels like it's in the teens. 17 in Howell is the current wind chill. It feels like it's only 13 in Lansing and Jackson, 18 in Monroe and 17 is the current wind chill in Gross Eel. Now tomorrow morning, we'll have those wind chills back into close to the single digits. But by the afternoon at this same time, we'll have low 20s for our wind chill. So we're kind of baby stepping our way to warmer weather. And by Thursday morning, wind chills will be in the 20s. So not much of a difference, but a little bit. Take a look at our temperatures over the next few days. 37 tomorrow, still below average for this time of year. But Thursday, we go above average with highs in the mid to upper 40s. And then we go back down to right about where we should be for this time of year in the low 40s for the end of the week. So 22 overnight tonight. That's at the airport. Suburbs a little bit colder than that. Light snow does return overnight tonight and through the first half of tomorrow. So keep that in mind for your morning commute. Even a little snow on the roads can definitely slow things down. 37 will be the high tomorrow afternoon before we finally get back into the 40s on Thursday. And then we stay there for a while. 46 degrees, 30, 41 on Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Both days will be in the low to mid 40s. And then Monday, we get rain with a high of 48 before cooling back down on Tuesday to 39. It's a lot to keep track of. If you'd like a refresher, I'll be back at 5 o'clock to give you that. All right, sounds good. Thank you, Kim.